This is 2821 N Street. It's a historic wood siding home. This is the entrance to the lower level. Beautiful homes to the left. Of course, you're in the heart of Georgetown. Just uh, one block up from M Street. And not too far from Washington Circle and the Foggy Bottom area. We're going to go ahead and go upstairs. The owner is home uh, with the nanny. Uh, the information I've got is that the owner bought this home just about a year, year and a half ago, but they actually have their heart set on another house that the listing agent is selling, and that's why they're moving. Coming in the front door, beautiful built-ins, crown molding, recessed light, original hardwood floors, been refinished view of the street. And this door will go downstairs to the lower level. We enter into the dining room. You see the stairs going up to the upper level. The dog is currently locked in the side yard, but just peek to show you the side yard. This is the side yard area. Beautiful built-in cabinets on either side of the entry leading to the kitchen. Moving into the kitchen. And sink. This looks like a uh, uh, cutting board surface. A window, recessed light. This is a thermidor, microwave, and oven combination. This is a thermidor uh, gas stove. The Kenmore Elite side by side refrigerator. This is a uh, tile. It's an older period looking tile. In the eat in kitchen area. Moving to the backyard through the glass doors. A wonderful garden. And this is the fence that leads to the side yard area. Flagstone on the patio. And moving up to a wood deck. Mature plantings. In the rear of the home. You see the uh, AC unit is a York up at the top there. It looks a little bit older, but of course your home warranty would be able to cover replacing, repairing or replacing that for only $55 if you had a problem. Coming back inside. We have Pantry. And on the other side, they actually have um, more clothing storage. Could be a pantry or coat closet. Moving upstairs, we have the runner on the wood stairs. A master bedroom forward and a hallway leading to the rear bedroom. We'll go into the master bedroom first. Beautiful. Uh, these look like original windows or older windows anyhow. Large closet, crown molding, recessed lighting, built-in bookshelves. 
course the original hardwood floors. Moving to the rear of the house, there are skylights in the ceiling providing lots of light. This is a smaller bedroom with a closet. And another set of closets, window with a view of the side yard, transom windows. We have a bathroom, kind of tight in here, sliding glass door. Pedestal sink, medicine cabinet, over John. There's a blue tile here. Continuing to move to the rear, we have another bathroom with black and white, looks like original tiles, tub. Sink. And the toilet. These are tight bathrooms here, but lots of light. We have a linen closet. We're moving back to the rear room. This is set up as a guest bedroom with a track lighting closet. Still on the original hardwood floors. We're going to move down to the basement. Coming down the stairs. And again, we're back to the living room and we'll go downstairs. These are a newer hardwood floor. See the stairway. This could be another bedroom or a recreation room. Here's the lower level front door. There's a newer contemporary track lighting. A little bit of storage space under the stairs. Moving to the rear of the house, this opens up into the laundry room with a washer dryer stack, basin sink, organizer shelving, and a bathroom with a pedestal sink, older fan. shower. Moving out, we have utility closet and finally the mechanicals. Looks like probably a 40 gallon water heater and the boiler for the radiator. And that is 2821 N Street.